Sir, I am the first to tout the capabilities of senior citizens. I've made love to many. You talking oldest bags? 68. That's not that old. Yeah, but I was only 20. 20? Were you even a cop then? No, man, it was before I got into the academy. Charles isn't talking about his oldest arrest. Ew! No, yes I, yes I am. Yeah, oldest arrest, 68, like I said. God, you had sex with a 68-year-old when you were in your 20s? You know how it is. When you have a chance to bed an older woman, you... No, that is not an older woman. That's an old woman. That's someone's grandma. She was, actually. That's how I met her. Oh. Went to college with her grandson, Marvin. Oh, no. don't, don't knock it to your trick. She had a replacement hip with some serious torque. No. It's like having sex with a transformer. Ah, pepper relish on your arancini. Very playful. Cut through the richness, add a little levity. I love that. You really know your food. Well, you could say it's the only thing I'm allowed to talk about. I need your help moving this old Miss Pac-Man machine I just bought. Why are you so obsessed with that game? Because it's the sexiest video game ever. She's insatiable, Rosa. Insatiable. Insatiable. Stop saying insatiable. Oh, boy. Well, hello. I heard you guys were making the rounds again. All right. <clears throat> this one's all you, Tiger. Come on. Because we played you. If you actually knew me, you would have known that I only agreed to do who knows mo, friend or foe, or you for real or just for show in order to stall. I was in on it. Estelle Minderman is the code word we use for when there's a twist, because when Estelle hosts game night at the Senior Center, she always makes sure one of the games has a sexy twist. And when I was... <sighs> I can't believe I'm Frenching in the closet. <sighs> I feel like a teenager. I feel like I'm 40 again. Chewing this sheet's a leaf. It'll give her kissing. Umami flavor. <laughs> she recognized you. This is Helen. Who's Helen? Oh, that's my husband, Solomon. I'm, I'm not really her husband. You're so much shorter than you used to be. What did the Japanese do to you? Different generation. OK, this is Ethel Musterberg from the Prospect Heights Senior Center. There was an ID card in her back pocket. Why was your hand in her back pocket? Well, she told me she didn't have any ID, and unlike Boyle, my first instinct was not to caress her butt. Frisked! I frisked her butt! What the hell, man? You said you were gonna sober them up. It's her fault. My girls are never gonna grow up and lose their virginity. I lost my V-card to the woman that refilled Nana's oxygen tanks. Her hands were so strong from turning the nozzles. <laughs>